so yeah, man, you know, another day in the life. Um, I guess, you know, today's whole purpose is training um, some professionals from across the West Midlands. Got quite a mixed bag today. We've got people from criminal justice, youth offending, um, schools, head teachers, pastoral care. We've got a few third sector youth organisations doing detached outreach work. Um, I think we had a few people that worked in housing, family support, therapy. So quite a mixed bag, as I said. And I guess the whole purpose of our training in partnership with the Violent Reduction Partnership um, is about what I call creating a standard. I think a lot of us that are working in this particular space, children, young people, supporting families, a lot of us are very passionate, but I don't think a lot of us are intellectual. And I guess part of the training that we do on these programs is really bringing that national standard back people really understanding the kind of, the, the techniques, the skills, the attributes that's required to work with children and young people in a range of different ways, in a range of different settings, and really just upskilling them to the point where if there is sadly another incident that happens in our community that people are able to respond. So that's the kind of gist of some of the things that we're covering today. Um, and probably throughout the day, you'll probably get bits of, you know, some of the session and maybe some sound bites from the individuals that are doing their thing. So today is a great day over at Solf HQ. Um, we're, we're doing a couple of things today. We've got Craig delivering some training. Um, he's delivering his understanding gangs and criminal exploitation. This is a piece of um, training put on by the VRP. So we're sort of halfway through at the moment. Um, there's, a, there's a few more sessions to go. On top of that, we're also in office working with some of our um, up and coming youth workers our volunteers and also a new placement student. So we have Tiger. Tiger is um, sort of like a veteran now. Um, he's been working with Solve since conception. So Tiger's here to support not, not just um, as last year he did as a participant, but this year he's actually supporting the delivery of the Natlas Fly program. We also have um, Amara. Amara has supported us throughout with um, her amazing graphic design skills. She's also supporting um, and aiding us through uh, this year's cohort of the Natlas Thrive journey. Um, she'll be supporting with uh, the design of the day. Um, and some of the workshops that we will be delivering. We also have uh, Malaika who has joined us from Birmingham City University. She is in her first year of um, the youth work degree. What about young people that get caught up in county lines? What about if you've got a young person that somebody says, you should hold these knives for me, or you should look at these weapons. What do we do with those young people? And then secondly, what happens if there's a young person that says, I'm talking to a stranger that I don't actually know that's saying to me, I should come over to Syria. And they said, I should make my way through Turkey and then end up in Syria because there's loads of brilliant things happening over here. And then the response I got was, oh, we didn't think of that. or oh, we don't really have a system that works with that type of thing. I'm really enjoying the passion that Craig's putting across in what he's doing um, and I think that it's really bringing up a lot of like kind of thought process for me and like oh maybe I need to do this or maybe I need to think about that or whatever and I think that's the thing that I'm taking most from today is the importance of understanding and knowledge. My mind's been quite blown by the experience I've just said that to uh, somebody a moment ago and um, there's a lot to take in there's a lot of things that I need to reflect on and think about how I can put things into context within our school but also across the other schools that I'm working with at the moment. The biggest thing I'm going to take away is just uh, really pushing myself to meet the standard of finding how we can best serve them and understanding that I'm not always going to be the most equipped, but I can point people towards those who are more equipped to help them and we can all work together using our different skills to help these young people.
in the violence. It's not violence, it's called manners and respect. It's called violence and discrimination. Come on, to this. Take a course. Oh, yeah, one to the ask as well. Who had that black thing on? Did you try to wipe it off? I don't know what that was, that you know, um, Craig. I was looking at it this morning, like, Craig. oh no, like, he's coming here. No, no, no. Partying Craig. or something. I come in here and I was like. <laughs> and you got a key through this office? I'm a tiger. He's like, be in here partying when I'm not here, you know. Because I've just seen some black stain thinking that that's no elbow. That's no. Listen, I want me, I want some food now. Come on, man. Food. I want food. Oh, what did you get? No. Oh, you got fries, no chicken. You got fries. Are you trying to um, palm her off with some um, hummus and some? I'm egg. feeling, man. I'm hungry. As you know, one thing at Solve, we love Nando's. So if you come to the office, you get a Nando's on me. <laughs> So I'm going to say this now and everybody's going to want to come down and get a free Nando's. That's what I'm here. I just want my chicken, man. I got chicken. I got chicken. It's not the Time's flying today. Yes. Two hours yeah. left. Oh, I'm just doing social media and ending it from here. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, I got wings, sorry. <coughs> I have wings. Why do I feel like this is only one piece of chicken, though? It's not. And this is my half? Oh, it's a quarter. Why you get me a quarter chicken? Who gets quarter chicken? It's because, you know what I did? Nah! <laughs> you know what I forgot, oh, yeah? God. You know what I did? But why would you get a quarter chicken? I forgot what I did. That don't even make no sense. No, no, you know what it makes sense? Because I ordered a platter. Nah, man. I mean, Wait. why me chicken? That's, that's what chicken is this? Wings. What flavour? It's probably tamer, though. Okay. Is that okay? I can't believe you got me a quarter oh. chicken. No, it's because I ordered a platter. Oh. I couldn't order two platters.